God of the harvest, bless us all with your gifts from land and sea, and give us thankful hearts for the creativity of mankind. Fill us with the fruits of your spirit, and let all creation sing your praises. We ask this in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And for this programme, we've harvested some of the best in North Yorkshire community talent, as we've specially commissioned an arrangement of local monk Cadman's hymn from distinguished composer Richard Shepherd. Now, the modern English version is by Mary Holtby, and it's performed by James Bywater and Jessica Wright. Let us praise the Creator of heaven and earth. From the darkness of chaos, new light he plucked forth. Let us praise him for his purpose, his power let us read. The Father of glory, our Lord and our King. The marvel of the heavens no mortal may span, but he made it for a roof and a covering for man. There was a thought dwelling, the sun for light, and he scattered the stars on the ceiling of night. Let us praise him, the creator of angels and men, of the tree in the forest, the beast in his den, of the great and the lowly, the earth and the skies, who is strength to the simple and wit to the wise. Just as Cadman heralded the dawn of English sacred music here on Yorkshire's east coast, so it's equally fitting that for our final hymn, we follow the setting sun to the very west of my native Wales, to a community united by fishing, farming and faith in the tiny cathedral city of St David's.
Next week, I chat with singer Tony Christie about his faith and a long career that's impressed some famous faces. Tony has a timeless voice. If he has a song that tells a story, there's no one better, really. And he leads friends and fans in some favourite hymns and songs. Music